Good afternoon everyone and thank you for your presence with us today. I am Rohel Mari, son of Matir Balach Mari, who gave his life almost nine years ago for a free Balochistan. 13th November is a day we will never forget. Every year we mark 13th November our National Remembrance Day, Baloch Martyrs Day, to pay tribute to tens of thousands of Baloch children, women and men who sacrificed their lives to pave the way towards freedom. Today, the whole motherland Balochistan cries for its victims. Tens of thousands of names, tens of thousands of snatched lives, tens of thousands of destinies slayed, tens of thousands of laughters that will never be heard again. Tens of thousands of voices forcefully silenced forever. Tens of thousands of disfigured, mutilated and unrecognizable corpses dumped like trash. These kids, these women and these men because they were Balochistan, they were slaughtered. Because they embodied a vision of freedom, they were slaughtered. Because they wanted to protect the honor of our motherland, stained shamelessly and ruthlessly by Pakistan, they were slaughtered. In this very deep and painful day of commemoration, where all the Baloch and its diaspora and supporters of this cause are united. I address on my name a compassion and solicitude to the families of the fallen ones. I know their pain and the scar they carry into the deepest parts of their soul as I still mourn the death of my father, Balach Mari, and we all pray that they rest in peace. So the question is, what does Pakistan want? Divide us and throw us against each other? Deprive our youth from every basic right? Rape our women and mutilate and kill our men? Steal our resources and keep our people under the poverty line? And ignore basic human rights? to cleanse the Baloch from Balochistan, to ensure there isn't a future for Balochistan. Hateful, destructive, thieves and religious fanatics, twisting and shamelessly betraying a religion to serve their own needs. A religion that clearly states whoever kills an innocent life, it is as if he has killed the whole of humanity. This enemy we should all be united against. I assure you, we will be united. We will neither be intimidated by the fear they try to make us feel, nor by their hatred. Determined to walk to our freedom step by step and make Balochistan a doorway to peace. Long live Balochistan, long live its children and its supporters all over the world struggling every day for its freedom. May all its martyrs rest in peace and be proud of our fights. They are gone but never forgotten. Thank you very much.